Um, some of them might not survive, but hopefully, fingers crossed, uh, most of them will. My name's Luke, and I come from a small town called Carnarvon in North Wales. I'm a chef by trade, but in my spare time, I like to come up with weird and wonderful business ideas. This time, to keep me motivated, I thought I'd bring you along for the ride. So sit down, relax, and let's build a business together. Hi there. In this video, I'm going to be cloning one of my uh, dragon's breath plants. So uh, I'll be propagating it and trying to get roots. Um, I'm going to take nine pieces and I'm using the Clonex rooting home hormone. And uh, I will be putting it into my new Aero Garden Bounty. So um, I'll get the dragon's breath plant out of here. And then um, I'll cut nine pieces up. And I'll uh, just show you how I go about propagating it. So I've gone ahead and cut off my cuttings. Uh, some of them are a bit small, but I'll uh, I'll choose the nine best ones. And then what I'm going to do is uh, use the uh, Aero Garden Grow Anything uh, pod kit. And first of all, I will dip them in some Clonex rooting hormone, just to give them a fighting chance of creating a root. Um, I'll just set up the uh, the Aero Garden and uh, put you pop you in a tripod and then uh, i'll uh, show you how to uh, use the clonex to uh, to put on the bottom of your cuttings back in a bit i've put you the aero garden together um now and i've put a little bit of the uh, clonex rooting hormone in a lid Right, this plant here is already got some roots going on. Uh, this uh, this was the bottom of the plant, so I'll simply put this directly into one of the growing baskets from the Aero Garden. Um, try and uh, not to damage the roots. There we go. And I'll just screw this down a little bit. That'll do. I'll pop this in the uh, in the middle of the aero garden. Right. So let's take care of our cuttings. To start with, I will uh, wet these uh, little sponges. And uh, I'll just pop them into the water in the aero garden to uh, wet it down a little bit. Once I've done that, I'm just going to cut down a little bit. Just enough to hold one of the cuttings in. I'll take one of the small ones. Right. I've cut it on a 45 degree angle. There. Um, with these tiny ones, we're okay. Uh, won't need to take any of the bark off. But uh, with the big ones, which I'll do in a bit, I'll show you how to take the bark off. But we'll just dip it in the growth hormone, the rooting hormone, and then pop it in our sponge, then into one of these grow baskets, and there's another one done. I'll just pop this 
straight in the aero garden. Okay, let's do another one. Wet the sponge up a little bit. And let's see which ones do now. Another small one, so we just need a little cut in there. Pop the bottom of the stem in the Clonex. Well, just pop that right in the hole and then into one of the net baskets. Try again, pop that one in properly. It's a little bit small this one, so it's uh, a little bit fiddly to get into the sponge. Push it right down to the bottom. And there we go, pop it in the aero garden. So we've got three all together. Um, I'll do one of these woody bits so uh, you can have a look. So I've cut this just underneath the node. And uh, what I'm going to do with this one is just remove some of the top bark with the knife. That'll help the uh, the rooting process. Just let the uh, roots come out the sides as well as from the bottom. There we go. That's enough there. I'll just pull off this little node here. And the leaf by the node. Just leave a little bit of leafage on. Um, just so it gets a head start. I'll pull this little node off as well. Right. I'll leave that down there for now. And I'll have to cut this a little bit more than I did with the other ones so I'll just dip it into some water make it a bit softer all right I'll split it about an inch down pull some of these top leaves off Dip in the hormone and push it as far down as you can. I'll just widen that hole a little bit. And go a bit deeper. There we go. That should bit okay in the net and pop it into the aero garden right I'll uh, just finish popping the rest of these into the aero garden and then uh, I'll show you the end results see you in a bit So there we go, that's all the little cuttings propagating in the Yarrow Garden. Uh, hopefully we should have nine more plants growing roots that we can put into the polytunnel soon. Um, some of them might not survive but 
hopefully, fingers crossed, uh, most of them will. Um, I will come back and shoot another video in about a week or two just to show how they're doing and if there's any um, roots growth on them. I'll see you then. Ta-da! So it's uh, been a couple of weeks now and most of the small cuttings that I did have uh, withered away and died. I think I might have put the light too close to the plants in the start but um, we've got four that uh, have survived. Um, obviously the one uh, with the big roots on that we had and I've had a little look on the bottom of the uh, the other three and they seem to be rooting a little bit um anyway uh, that's it for this video um i'll shoot another video soon just to show you how these are doing and uh, to show me uh show you me replanting these into pots okie dokie i'll see you in the next video Ta -ra. if you like the video guys please subscribe We'll be giving away free prizes after we reach a thousand subscribers. Uh, please also like and comment. We like to know what you think of our videos. We'll uh, see you on the next video.